The quality of this latest pickup video is about to dramatically increase in 3, 2, 1. So today I'm going to be doing a latest pickup video on the gifts that I received for Christmas. Christmas is over. <laughs> no, but seriously, Christmas is over. And I'm very upset about it. It's probably my favourite holiday. I'm not doing this video to be in competition with anyone. I'm not bragging. I just know that you guys would want to see it. So, obviously, as you can tell, I got a new camera. I got the Canon 700D. I paid about £390 for it. It was second hand, but it came with a case another lens and some other stuff really happy with it obviously I don't know 100% what I'm doing yet I probably won't four months but it's interesting and it's a lot better than my previous camera so I'm happy about that what we it wouldn't be Christmas without a link set I'll start with clothes because I know how much you all love clothes this unique low lounge set it's a jumper and then tracksuit bottoms. Really happy with that. Nice to sleep in when it's really, really cold. This Supreme Merry Christmas tea. I actually got this for a really good price. Paid retail off of someone that could have made a lot more money. Got this unique low cashmere sweater. Well, it's 90% cotton, 10% cashmere, but I really love it. Less streetwear, more smartish. This Supreme Devil Tea. Funny story about that is that my dad had a devil tattoo and it was really shit and he got it covered up. So when I saw that I just had to get it. Here are three things that I actually got before Christmas, but the basement Facebook group Secret Santa came through. Star Wars. He gave me two Star Wars teas. Just chew backer on it. The new movie is amazing by the way in my opinion. And then this Mickey Mouse hoodie. Just got that continuing on the sort of middle of the hoodie, front and back. Unique low jumper. It looks kind of similar to the lounge one actually, but I promise it's different. I really love Unique Clo. They're doing some great stuff and it's affordable. Like, I ain't a rich kid. This shirt. I like this shirt because it's really soft. I looked and it said 100% cotton. I know this is going to sound stupid, but some shirts are like rigid, so I guess that's a different material. I need to up my fashion game. I don't 100% know. I don't even 60% know stuff. And since we were showing the stuff that I got before Christmas, um, two presents that I got early, Black Ops 3. It's an alright game. I'm going to do a video about what I think of games from 2015 and Rainbow Six Siege. Love that game. Obviously it's flawed, but love that. So, Lush. Lush. If you don't know what Lush is, you need to go there. It's a little bit feminine, but I love like, they do bombs that you throw in the bath and it makes it real crazy colors. Look at this one, it's fucking Santa. If you watch my vlogs, then you'll know what bath bombs. I love a good bath. Hotel Chocolat. Salted caramel, hot chocolate, that is that good stuff. You need to try that. It was like, I was there when my girlfriend bought me that actually. It was like £10, which is pretty ridiculous. You get what you pay for in life. Friendly, disgust emotion from the film Inside Out. Disney film, Disney Pixar, really love that movie. Halo 5 Master Chief Controller. I love me some Halo 5. Just Cause, in which it hasn't even been opened yet. Just Cause 3. Adventure time. <laughs> I bought this today. I know it's going to be shit. Tony Hawk, Pro Skater 5. I've heard it's fucking awful, but I really want to have a look for myself and make my own decision. Uh, this. Orky. Orky. Portable charger. Apparently meant to charge my iPhone 6S seven times, which is quite nice. A cactus candle. Uh, I really like cactuses, although both of mine have died now. Uh, I didn't realise you're meant to actually water them. I thought they survived without water. So, happy with that. More chocolate. If you have got a Hotel Chocolat store, 
then you need to go there ASAP. It is the best place on earth. And buy one of these. Well, not this particular slab. This slab is nice, but there are better. Don't want to sound like a brat. They're like £16. They're really fit. I suppose I could get it out. There it is. I suppose it don't look that thick, actually. But it's fucking like 600 grams. It's amazing. They use really good quality chocolate as well. I got a slab in September and I didn't finish it till like December, end of November. But you could, you could easily eat it like all in one night, especially when they've got caramel chocolate in them. More chocolate, that's why we all love Christmas really, isn't it? Xbox vouchers from Game, the worst corporate business in the world. Hate them so much. I bought Rainbow Six Siege season pass with one of them. The other one, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe Halo 5 season pass. I don't even know where to start. Do gifts from middleman and count? I mean, they're Christmassy chocolate. It's reindeer. Here is the box from the Halo 5 controller. Master Chief. Best character in a video game by far. Maybe Spyro the Dragon comes close. This present is wild. I didn't imagine that I would ever get this. This is gonna take like the most pride of place. I don't quite know where yet, but goddamn, that is cool. It's from the Disney Showcase Collection between Disney and Brito. Brito, I don't know, I don't know. I, I saw that in a shop and I just liked it and I told my mum and I forgot about it. So when I opened that, I was really happy. More chocolate, fucking focus on my face. Heroes, love them. Reese's spread, chocolate and peanut butter, two great inventions in which I'm very thankful for to this day. Uniqlo boxes, oh, I had some Uniqlo socks, but I've been wearing them, so I'm not gonna show you some dirty socks or something. Jellies, hand puppets, talking of socks. Do you know, I actually love socks. If people wanna buy me socks for Christmas, then go ahead. I'll be very thankful. Dinner tray. My mum is weird. My mum will literally buy me like toothpaste for Christmas. <laughs> Stuff that I need. Like, I, I like that though. Uh, a man bowl. Gonna put a funny Instagram photo up of that. Might even have a collar. Star Wars. Disney BB-8. The new R2-D2. My battery died while I was filming. If you're wondering why the angle and general picture has changed a little bit. You you saw the Star Wars, yeah? <laughs> Good. BB-8, great character. If you've seen Inside Out, this is Bing Bong. He's one of the characters from Imagination Land. Smells of cotton candy. One of my favorite presents, that is. M&S Sweet Collection. M&S Olaf Frozen Chocolate. You know he's one of the best characters, where is he? there. Pop a cob. So some weird put it in the microwave. This is mostly stocking stuff that you're seeing now. This is my stocking that I have. I'm just a big kid I know, I'm sorry. You shouldn't be watching this channel if you can't appreciate that. Bath jelly. Yeah, that's cool. More things from Lush. This is uh, says Santa's belly. Shower jelly. How weird that is. This was probably the best cracker ever. It was like that. Popped it open. You know, it had a little hat and a little stupid boy thing. This weird shaver. Of course it contained an orange. Some bath bombs from The Good Dinosaur. What a great movie that is, by the way. More unique low boxes. Shaving gel. <laughs> I have sensitive. A ped egg, the dead skin on your feet, lovely. Munchies, another lush soap thing. Bug eating plant, that's cool. Toffee apple, lolly. Chocolate penny and a scratch card in which I won two pound. These new Converse's, the Converse 2. I'll probably do a video on these soon. Box, I know you guys love boxes. And then Cats doing yoga. So those are my Christmas present cards. <laughs> God. Obviously that card, that card was from my girlfriend. Uh, that card was from my mum, Chris Simpson's artist. 
That card was from my dad. That card was from one of my brothers. That card was from my friend. And then all these, you know, just random friends, family, that just general Merry Christmas ones focus on my face for fuck's sake. Um, so there we have it. The presents that I got for Christmas. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Let me know about the camera, the angles, like, I hope I'm improving. I know that I didn't make that the most professional video. I know that it didn't have the best eye and t-shirts and stuff, but this is real life. And working with the best of my abilities, and my equipment, you know, stuff like that. It's not going to be the best channel in the world. I'm, I wouldn't ever want it to be. I, Watching Casey Neistat the other day, he said, don't let perfect get in the way of good enough. And I felt like this is good enough. Uh, my subscribers now 1,700 and something. Hopefully that reaches 2,000 soon. <laughs> uh, but thank you. Thank you all. I hope that these are getting better and more confident than the general shit. Thank you for watching this. Shout out to Lou for selling me that Christmas tea at a very, very good price. And shout out to Mafias for editing this for me. Hopefully one day I can give you something back for all the editing you've done. Thanks for watching this guys and appreciate all the support and shit.